My name is Paula Reddy. I work for the County of San Bernardino Department of Child Support Services for a little over 15 years. I'm also the president of San Bernardino Public Employees Association. We're here today to watch the um, public hearings regarding um, pension reform. We're concerned about the governor's proposal with the hybrid plan in that uh, the stock market has not been tremendously successful. So asking people to not count on something that's been promised to them all along and base their survival in the future on the stock market and its ups and downs is very scary to a lot of our people. So um, I come from a long line of public employees. Um, a lot of the conceptions that people have about the overinflated public pensions is hogwash, for lack of a better word. Um, my parents both retired from um, a government entity. My father retired from the state of California um, Department of Corrections. My mother retired from the Toronto Public Library. Their combined pension was $1,800 a month. They were very lucky in that the state did pay their post-retirement medical. As a county employee, um, when I retired, the county does not make any contributions at all to our medical care afterwards. So we'll be subjected to whatever we can buy um, or to Medicare. So knowing that a lot of my retirement income will have to go to the purchase of medical insurance for myself and I have a child with autism, um, I'm very concerned about having that money secure and being able to predict and plan ahead and know what money is going to be coming to provide for my family in the future.